Your Highnesses, Excellencies, Ladies and Gentlemen, my gratitude to His Royal Highness, Prince Mohammed bin Salman, for convening this vital gathering. Over the past year, incredible humanitarian endeavors, coupled with the power of technology and healthcare, have protected lives and underpinned economies. And while we must not forget the lives lost or the support communities need to get back on track, the new COVID vaccines are giving us a path out of the pandemic. For governments and investors, the recovery is going to require patience and agility. Global vaccine distribution is vital to move forward. The world will not overcome COVID by turning inwards or leaving nations behind in the vaccination effort. This is why the UE has set up a global vaccine distribution hub to reach over 170 countries. As we navigate our way through this pandemic and look ahead, we see the next decade will be defined by how the global community takes action on climate change, the energy transition, ensuring level access to healthcare, digital connectivity, and inclusive education and economic growth. It is not a trade-off between society and value creation. They go hand in hand. Together, we have to keep pursuing economic roadmaps that ensure trade, prosperity, and equal opportunity in tomorrow's world. We have to remove the barriers and create ecosystems for innovators to thrive. Challenging convention and pushing the boundaries on critical issues now will enable a more sustainable and inclusive world for future generations. That is why I am grateful for forums such as FII to bring us together to chart collective action. I wish you all a successful summit and look forward to playing our part in a global recovery defined by greater collaboration.